How much money do you need to open a Swiss bank account? To open a Swiss bank account as a non-resident, you need at least 1 million Swiss francs. Normally, Swiss banks ask for more. They ask for 3, 5 or even 10 million Swiss francs. I will show you how you can open a Swiss bank account with 500,000 Swiss francs only in 10 days. How to choose the best Swiss bank that safeguards and grows your money and how to best negotiate the terms and conditions. Stay with me. Caputo and Partners, SwissBankingLawyers.com. We fight for your money. Hello. I am Enzo Caputo, a Swiss banking lawyer and the owner of the boutique law firm Caputo & Partners. I work for the old UBS group in the legal and compliance department. For more than 30 years, I have been advising wealthy clients from all over the world. 20 years ago, I launched the domain SwissBankingLawyers.com. That's the place where successful international business people like you find tips and solutions to better protect assets with Swiss banks, pay less tax and make more money. The world has become more insecure. Never in history have Swiss banks opened so many bank accounts as last year. Opening a Swiss bank account is the first step successful entrepreneurs take to protect their assets. You should do the same if you want to secure the financial future of your family. Do you know that 30% of all private assets on the planet are managed in Switzerland? All these successful people, all the owners of 30% of all bankable cross-border assets in the world can not be wrong. Opening a Swiss bank account is an important and smart decision. The average duration of a Swiss bank account is 17 years. You need money for rainy days outside of your country of residence. Transfer your money out of the influence of the courtrooms at home. Switzerland is the safest place on earth for bankable assets. The Swiss bank account opening procedure has become challenging. You cannot walk into any bank in Switzerland with your driver's license and $10 in your hands. Swiss banks are very selective in dealing with new clients from abroad. However, they welcome non-resident clients with large amounts of money for long-term investments. Swiss banks like non-resident clients being introduced by somebody they trust, by somebody like me, for example, by somebody taking care of the know you customer rules. To open a Swiss bank account as a non-resident, you need at least 1 million Swiss francs. That's the minimum. Normally they ask for more. They ask for three, five or even 10 million, like Citibank, for example. If you open your account with me, we can start with 500,000 Swiss francs only. I work with selected external asset managers. I have cooperated with them for more than a decade. My asset managers are, first of all, honest and fair people. That's super important. They will grow your portfolio step by step. My asset managers have billions deposited with the banks. Some of them are bigger than banks. The bank will not reject my smaller clients with 500,000 Swiss francs only. They know exactly that I'm, I can introduce also ultra high net worth individuals to them. A minimal deposit of 1 million Swiss francs is the limit. With smaller amounts, it's more difficult to achieve a secure level of investment diversification. Diversification of investments is crucial for mitigating the investment risks. I advise non-resident clients from all over the world. There is a very frequent misconception among non-resident investors. They think the bigger the bank is, the safer it is. That's not true. The biggest banks are not always the best. I avoid banks involved in risky activities such as derivatives and investment banking. I avoid banks giving loans to companies. I avoid banks doing trade finance, issuing standby letter of credit, issuing bank guarantees. The safest Swiss private banks we suggest have no leveraged balance sheet as many banks have in the European Union. 
Better is to consider smaller and solid banks focused on wealth management only. The wealth management business is a low risk business compared to other banking business activities. I like banks that have been around for 200 years and have solid balance sheet. We will not approach the bank before all documents are impeccable. We need a passport copy, a driver's license is not enough, a short CV, a resume, a utility bill to show the physical residence of the client and we need documents evidencing the origin of funds. The typical origin of funds documentation can be connected, for example, to an IPO, inheritance, donation, the sale of real estate, company or assets, divorce, business dividends, loan, employment income, lottery or savings. If the origin of funds is based on sensitive activities like gambling, nightclubs, adult entertainment, defense industry, precious metals, mining and diamonds, it will be difficult to open accounts in Switzerland. It's better to not mention such activities and open such accounts somewhere else. We will advise the client to consider another jurisdiction. If the bank is uncomfortable because of the source of funds, we will find another bank in Switzerland. You should never lie to the bank. That's very important. I had a client who has kept his activities about adult entertainment secret. The bank discovered the adult entertainment activities and immediately kicked out the client. However, we found a good Swiss bank accepting him. Swiss banks are very strict in protecting their good reputation. It takes decades to build up a good reputation and a few seconds to destroy it. We will check your reputation on Google and WorldCheck before introducing you to the bank. A negative post on Google can be eliminated before the account opening procedure starts. We know the internet and SEO companies specialize in such services. Negative surprises should be avoided. When our clients are meeting the bank, the original funds should be crystal clear. We are focused on long-term banking relationships. We want happy clients for many years. Insider information just like this cannot be found in universities, in libraries and not in the internet. If you like information just like this, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel now and ring the bell. Click the subscribe button and ring the bell. By doing so, you will never miss a new video. If you have a very confidential question you would like to discuss with me, grab your mobile phone now and dial 0041442124404. It's never too early to protect and diversify your assets, but often too late. Capital export restrictions are coming soon. They come overnight as a surprise. Bring your money to Switzerland as long as it is legal. Bring your money out of your country before your country will take your money out of you. Be rich and stay rich. Have a wonderful day.